Hey guys, welcome back to X Plays Half Life 2. So I missed a switch somewhere, and I've got a pretty good idea of where. <laughs> I just kind of annoyed that head, head crab with that barrel. I was trying to pull the barrel up so I could use it as a weapon, but I don't seem to have to reach on this thing for that. So it's time to make my way back to that previous room to hit that switch. Looking for an easy way to get across, but short of running all the way back around, I don't see a quick way. So that's exactly what I do. Just run all the way back around. Man, those guys can take such a beating. They are the tanks of this game. Well, I guess technically a tank <laughs> would be a tank in this game. There's the switch. But no, I mean they're the uh, <laughs> they're the high HP zombies that take all the punishment. I should have killed that zombie that I just ran by. Because it's some guy suffering. I didn't think about it till now. Maybe just to make myself feel better, I'll go back and load that save game and go shoot that zombie. <laughs> or maybe not. Alright, I've made it across. Not where. Not where. Not where. Oh, look, a trail of supplies leading up to a ladder. Hey! Seems. Seems I have some cover. Whoa. Being very cautious. But with Father Gregory out there. I feel fairly safe that nothing's going to come into the window. Oh, that's good to know. I didn't know the gravity gun could push back. Now, why would they put a loading screen here? It seems that if you're going to put a loading screen somewhere, you shouldn't really put enemies by it. There we go. Ah! There's so little I could do there. Except just let those things bite me till I got up. Before I go out that door, I want to go check what was down those stairs. And this room I recognize, so I'm just going backwards at this point. Let's head back up. This video is a little short, guys, because uh, this is where I started to run out of hard drive space, so tune in next time.